Hi, welcome to the Academy of Photography. Buy one, get one free. I'm Christian Tudor and today we're going to talk about search engine optimization. Today I would like to talk about search engine optimization. This is the most powerful marketing tool for any business in uh, today's context. This is probably the most valuable lesson if you have any business more than anything. Uh, today being visible in Google is the most important aspect of a business success. If people cannot find you online, you do not exist. How many people in this room believe that being in the front page of Google is a big deal? I know I do. Being in the first page in Google brings traffic to your website and increases your business without any questions. In today's context, people do not look to find information anywhere else but Google. Yellow pages, pink pages, white pages or whatever color pages you have in your area, they are dying. People do not go through printed magazines anymore. They do not go through traditional places that you would think. People Google stuff every day more and more. Also, Google is the most powerful search engine tool today and the most popular by far. It is cl close to 90%, very unlikely to be caught by the others like Bing, Yahoo or whoever. People do not Facebook services, do not Bing or Yahoo information. People today Google things. The reason I wanted to share this with you today is that I celebrate few years of effort and I have achieved finally first page ranking for my business in my area for my specific keyword. Just to make a clear example, I'm talking about wedding photographer Sydney, that's the keyword, because I'm a wedding photographer and I'm in Sydney and this is what I'm trying to promote. And this, is, uh, this keyword is one of the most valuable keywords for, for my business. I have found out through keyword uh, research. Before I move on and show you what to do to get there, I wanted to share some of the experience and history to put things into context. I have watched my site and Google how they behave over the years and try to do all the things recommended by other people to be done in order to get in the first page. I have failed many times and I have spent a lot of time and money paying other people to do it for me who call themselves uh, SEO specialists, search engine optimization specialists. Also I need to tell you how I believe Google sees things in order to understand what I am about to tell you today. When people type a specific keyword they are interested in, Google uses softwares and applies algorithms to find websites containing your search phrase or keyword and arranges them in the order of relevancy. Now about relevancy, how do you measure which site is more relevant over another site if they both or all of them contain the words you are looking for? In answer to this question, Google has developed complex criteria and uh, assigns marks for every website based on hundreds of signals and hundreds of criteria. Basically, they are looking for the following things. They look on the title of the website. They look at the title of the pages inside the website. How many pages contain your keyword and how many times? how many images named with your keyword, how many internal links containing the word are in your website, how many other websites point to your website and how many links contain the keyword. Do you have meta description? Just for those ones who are not technical, meta description is a hidden text which is usually, usually part of the design and usually that can contain also a keyword. How many people visit your website searching for that keyword? How old is your website? How big is your website? How many pages and what structure of the pages you're using? How many uh, synonyms of the keyword you have in your website and how even they are distributed among the website? Do you have social media affiliate sites? How many likes do you have on Facebook? How many likes you have on Google Plus? Do you have Google reviews? Do you have other people's reviews? Do you have third party reviews? How many and how good they are? The, this list can go on and on and on and no matter what you do, you cannot satisfy all of them. There used to be loopholes in all of the above and there are thousands of internet cowboys out there pretending to know how Google works and try to sell you SEO services, that means search engine optimization services, but they cannot guarantee you anything. However, they are happy to take your money. I've been there, I've done that and I burned myself. 
it did not end up any good. Google is ruling them out slowly and it is now impossible to achieve performance by applying formulas like before. The only thing you need to do and worry is create a great content on your website, interesting and appealing. I have believed I have found formulas over the time and they used to work for some time and after a few months I would have fallen back. I'm gonna share with you a few tips what you can do to improve your chances to become more visible in Google and you might have a chance to increase your exposure and traffic. I'm not guaranteeing you first page but if you do the things I'm gonna tell you now you probably have a much better chance. First of all, you have to have a meaningful business name and a title of the website. You have to have a meaningful description of your website. Have meaningful and logical pages. Include clear titles and description of pages. Include as much text as you can and do not include the keywords too many times. You can build websites around a specific keyword, but I would suggest you don't do that. Include images with names. When you insert images like 1 to 3 JPEG, this does not have any meaning and Google will not see it, will not understand it. I'm going to give you an example. If you call an image beach wedding photo, Google will know what you're talking about and it will have a better chance to appear when someone types by chance wedding photo in Google and beach wedding photo and anything related. You can have a blog and write about every session in a separate page. This is probably one of the best things you can do. Do not call your pages John and Mary wedding but call them wedding photography at the White Palace for John and Mary. This is an example for wedding photography in my case. A much more meaningful title and Google will find it when someone types wedding photos at the White Palace. You associate the location with the photos and with the article. I'm just gonna give you an example. Every time I publish a, an article, I would associate the location with the words wedding and photography and I can guarantee you by placing a link to that specific venue every time someone searches for that venue and every time someone searches for wedding photos at that venue they end up in my page. If I do that with every venue I can guarantee within a year or two you cover I don't know how many venues you can do but let me tell you this is gold because every time you will pop up in other searches not necessarily for your specific search but also additional searches and this will bring traffic to your website. Every time you have a shoot just put it on a website. Ask for permission from your, your clients and describe your shoot and put a lot of text. Do not be short of text. I see many photographers and uh, they are just uploading pages with just images. Google cannot read that. If you do your, your keyword research for your business and you can find other related keywords you can use them for your articles and you can use them in your pages. I would suggest you do your research and, and I'm gonna give you an example how I do things. In my case the most valuable keyword for my business is wedding photography Sydney. I have a Google account and I have found related keywords in the Google account that comes free with a uh, research tool. I have found keywords like wedding poses, wedding photo ideas, pre-wedding sessions, beach wedding photography and many others. I'm using one keyword at, at one time for each article, blog post or page I write and I go about that one keyword in the context of my photo session. I create one article and over time I create one article every time I have a client and I insert one image named after that specific keywords. In this manner, if you change your behavior and you do as I do, I can promise you that your traffic will build up over time and people will come to your page more and more. More traffic means better Google ranking. Your site becomes more transparent and it will appear more often. And that is pure gold. I will stop here. I think this is already too much information in one go and I will suggest to do, to do the following. First, open a Google account find the best keywords for your business in your area make sure you specify your area because it's important that people don't look uh, for you in another town or another city you need to change your behavior as per my tips and you can measure the results in few months time 
If it doesn't work, just contact me and I'll tell you what are you doing wrong. Everything I just mentioned will not guarantee you the first page location because there are already people smart enough to do that. That's, that's your competition. But this will definitely put you on the map. I have tried to summarize the most important information in my opinion, but this discussion can take more than just an hour, just half an hour. If you have any specific questions, feel free to contact me. Send me an email, I'll be happy to answer. Also, if you want to test my theory, please go on Google. You type Wedding Photography Sydney and see what position I come up in. Think about your business, what services you offer and where. It is very important to do your homework and start building your image online. It is crucial for your business. It is crucial for today's success. In one of my previous videos, I talked about how easy it is to install the WordPress. You can install on your website a WordPress blogging platform. You start writing, do it on a, um, uh, not on a daily basis, but on a weekly basis. And I can promise you will get results within a few months time. I hope you enjoy my tips here in terms of search engine optimization. And holes boles protocoles. Until I see you next time, I wish you happy shooting. Thank you very much.